course, we all want to look our best for the rest of our lives. And I want to talk to you a little bit about what constitutes aging, what you can do to make uh, the process a lot easier. So when we talk about aging, it's important to talk about first what aging constitutes. So what does healthy skin look like? Well, let's look at this picture right here. This is a young person who has very healthy skin, hasn't had much sun damage. If you look, the purple part is nice and thick. That's the epidermis, the top layer of the skin. Very healthy. Now look at the pink. It looks like a nice fluffy pillow full of collagen. That's the thick, beautiful skin that you see in someone who's full. Now, what happens is as we get older, there's what's called intrinsic aging. This is just what happens biologically. Our skin undergoes certain changes. What happens is if now you look at the purple, the epidermis, it's gotten really thin. It looks like a little pencil mark. That's when your skin becomes fragile and you don't feel like it has as much bounce because there is the, the bottom layer, right, the dermis. You see how it's purple? It's got a lot of fragmented elastin and collagen. It's no longer as healthy and as viable because we've actually lost collagen and the skin has actually become a little dehydrated over time. Now, what do we do? We make the process a lot worse by what's called accelerated or extrinsic aging. We go and we get sun, right? So the UV damage, look at what it can do. So now if you look at the last picture, is that the, the epidermis, not only is it thin, but it looks dirty, right? Like women always talk about, oh, I'm so blotchy, I wanna have clear complexion, I hate these manchas. Well, look, it's the sun that actually causes that. You can actually see it under the microscope. Now look at the dermis. It's really dirty. It's full of these fragmented little purple lost elastin and collagen. So it's no longer able to function and have that bounce. But it also is not functioning very well because it's part of your immune system. And that part of your immune system is becoming weak because we have not taken care of it. So what can we do about this? Well, we've talked a little bit about how important it is to use good sun habits and to use great SPF. But there's actually more good news. So what I always tell my patients is what you want to do is build collagen. We go to the gym to build muscle. What we do for the skin is we want to build collagen and elastin. And how do we do that? Well, time and time again, the proven formula has been retinol. And retinols are basically vitamin A's. And when you can use that and be able to protect yourself from the UV radiation, you can actually reverse some of the signs of aging and restore the health of the skin. And Neutrogena has a product, it's called the Rapid Wrinkle Repair, that is basically a retinol. So let's talk about a little bit about what makes retinols the gold standard in building collagen. There's different kinds of vitamin A derivatives, and I'm not gonna bore you with biochemistry, but I can tell you that not all of them can penetrate the skin. If you actually put vitamin A on yourself, you may actually break out. So what you need is a form of vitamin A that can actually penetrate and go down to the dermis and activate the production of collagen. Okay? Well, in the office, we use prescription products, right? A lot of people know the retin A, the, the retinoic acid. But what if you want to use a gentler product? And what if you want to use something that you can do at home? Well, the retinol is the purest vitamin, form of vitamin A that can actually penetrate and be stable enough to be able to start the collagen production. So you can repair your collagen and kind of have your skin working for you the same way your muscles are working for you overnight. So this is an image I want to go over with you of what actually happened. So look at this cross section of the skin after using 24 weeks of this retinol versus placebo, which means nothing. The skin actually has what's called increased cell turnover, like the healthy skin becomes to turn over and the dead skin is basically exfoliate off, so you have more of a fresh complexion. The skin actually absorbs more water, becomes more vibrant, and there's enhanced collagen growth, so it actually your genes wake up and make more collagen. 